return for days. It's a beautiful day. What's up, guys? My name is Hafo, and uh, basically today it's a Sony Vegas tutorial on how to do that flash you've just seen in the uh, in the preview. It's a really, really easy effect, and uh, if you master it, it, looks pretty good. And as you will see in the timeline, I've created two markers. Um, I've split on the second marker, and the second marker is the shot itself. So we're creating one mar um, marker before I shoot on the beat, um, and one as we shoot. Now you will find it best to do this effect on a beat of some sort. Uh, it just you know, it just looks nice. And uh, basically, for, you want to split on the first marker as I've done. And you want to go to color curves on your um, effects and just drag in reset to none. Then you click animate on your little thing at the bottom. And you're just going to drag up your color curves like so. So you have that. Then you change the channel to blue and turn the blue a lot higher than the original color curve. Um, if you want to like look at the precise how I did mine, just pause it and look at how far I burned it up. Then I just saved my blue flash, um, my blue preset so I get it right in the future and I dragged across the timeline and I just reset to none like so and uh, that's basically that and as you will see as I drag it down the color correction just bends back and if we watch it over um, it just does like a blue flash and that may look a bit boring so um, I like to do mine with a bit of pan crop so we just right click and click um, uh, uh, you just click no, you just click event pan crop on there. I just turned up the blue a bit more because I didn't like how it looked. But it's up to you how much you want to turn up the blue. Doesn't really matter. It just depends on what type of look you're going for. So um, after I decided that looked pretty nice, you just want to click on your uh, event pan crop, and I basically just zoomed in um, on my. Uh, I just basically dragged the sides in, the edges, at the start. You have to animate this, by the way, so it says animate at the bottom. And then you just drag across to the end of the timeline, just reset to none, default. And that's just basically the zoom effect that I showed you in a few tutorials ago. And, um, yeah, that is pretty much it. That, is, that looks pretty sick. And as you'll see, like, as it shoot, as, like, the beat, um, sounds then you just get the zoom and the flash and it looks pretty sick so if you enjoyed this tutorial check out my channel because i have a lot more tutorials on vegas and after effects to do with call of duty editing or any editing so yeah um hope you enjoyed and please like the video thanks guys